I am Rachel Hearn, and you are watching The Piff Connection. Doesn't matter who you are, you can still reach for the stars. With a dream inside your heart, you can turn the world around. There are homeless in the streets, children still need food to eat. So tell me what's it gonna be? Should we be silent or work together? Imagine a world where we're living together, no matter the color, we love one another. My brothers and sisters are back. And we have Ambassador Richardson from the from Saint Lucia, and we have Ambassador Lily from the Taipei, um, the Taipei Cultural Office, which is right here where we're filming, watching all the films. So, Ambassador Richardson, tell us a little bit about what you're expecting to see tonight. Well, first of all, I I must say how proud I am to be here tonight to witness the creative talents of one of our own young Saint Lucians. It is really an honor for me to be here and, and I am always so happy to see young St. Lucians displaying their talents and growing up and, and, and making a contribution to the development of the arts and, and, and culture of, of St. Lucia. So it is, it, is a, it is an extremely, extremely important moment for me. Thank you. And Ambassador Lily, how is it that you came about into becoming part of this? Okay, I understand that Mr. the director, Mr. Charles, was here a couple of years back and he said, he told me he loved it so much so he came back. And we actually, we also are, are very honored and very proud to be part of this celebration because I understand this event is part of your uh, celebration of the 40th anniversary of independence of St. Lucia. So, and as a strong ally of the St. Lucia, Taiwan, and uh, we, our office is uh, functions just like a consulate counsel general. Right. So we are very, very proud to be part of this celebration. And I just want to say thank you so much for allowing us to be part of this experience with you here and working with you. We really do appreciate it. Thank you. Do you have anything to ask the wonderful people? Ambassador Richardson, <laughs> 40 years of St. Lucia's independence and we see lots of talent coming out of St. Lucia. Uh, Demetrius has put on some amazing films, four featured here this evening. In terms of the uh, encouragement for young people, any advice you have as we celebrate 40 years of independence to our St. Lucians who will be uh, listening to this? I think it's, it's 40 years since we have been independent, an independent nation on the world stage. And I think we've made much progress. We've made a lot of, of progress. What I would like to say to young persons is to persevere, be committed to persevering, to work hard, hold your country in high esteem, be proud of, of your country, your country's achievements, your own achievements, and working together with each other, with one another. It is important that we as St. Lucians cooperate, collaborate, and be together. And I think that is going to be the basis that is going to take us forward as a country. Yes, indeed. And uh, Ambassador Lily, xie xie, xie xie, xie xie. Thank you so much for being a part of this. Uh, for us, in terms of the collaboration and the support for cultural exchanges, cultural collaborations, how important it is, is it for you, your country, to be part of such a prestigious a celebration of 40 years of independence for St. Lucia? Okay, I truly believe that um, cultural uh, activities is serve as a, a bridge for mutual understanding and we are very proud that this event and is so considered very important to the St. Lucian people and government um, can can be here uh, know to be uh, we can be part of the event and I'm also want to point that out, Taiwan has always been a good partner to St. Lucia in promoting the uh, welfare of our people and there are currently more than 100 students yes studying in Taiwan so I believe they can serve as a bridge a very very important bridge for um, the, uh, the deep friendship and understanding between our two countries all right thank you very very much uh, we do appreciate your support we say thank you again and any questions you'd like to pose to the ambassadors um, I think in terms of um, 
the, the wonderful collaboration that you've had together um, also with the St. Lucia and um, being here in New York, in the fabulous New York. Um, what can you say to the actors to inspire them to continue with their careers and what, yeah, so what, what inspiration can you give to the actors in these movies today? It, well, we, we first established diplomatic relations with Taiwan in 1984. And one of the things we have noticed over time is it is not simply governments establishing relations, but it's the people, the people-to-people -people contacts, the people-to-people, -people, um, you know, approach, exchanges. We have had cultural exchanges with uh, Taiwan. We've had Taiwanese groups coming to St. Lucia to perform. We are also looking to have St. Lucian groups to go to Taipei to perform. And we need to work on that so that our two countries can understand each other even more than we have in the past. We have to understand each other's culture. We have to understand each, each other's priorities. And, and, and we have to share with each other our culture and, and our, 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 our strengths and, and weaknesses. And so working collaboratively, both as two countries and as our people, I think we can achieve a lot. Wow, that is very inspirational. Thank you very much. And um, is there something that you would like to add as well? Well, Ambassador Richardson summed up very, very well. <laughs> yes, uh, I can add just a little bit uh, for some uh, audience that don't know Taiwan that much, that Taiwan and St. Lucia are, has a lot of in common. We are both island countries with rich culture and uh, uh, natural beauties. And also, we, the people, all love movies. <laughs> so I think we have a lot in common. Absolutely fantastic. Thank you so much. Debbie, would you like to ask something? Yes. Um, as representative for Perth South Africa um, and everybody here from Perth, I would like to thank you guys for coming and being here with us tonight and everybody I would like to thank you and Miss Zanzi Africa and you for hosting and our camera lady over there. <laughs> And thank I hope you, you enjoy your evening and we, the forms. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bless. South Africa has some excellent thank representatives you. over thank here you. in New York and we work very closely with them. Oh, that's well, awesome. Thank you. We will appreciate and we will enjoy everything. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Because of the cultural exchanges that our countries share, and we have so many students who go over and come back and speak Chinese. Uh -huh. We want to appreciate your language as well. So I'd love you to give a message in Chinese uh, to our audience celebrating this evening. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. 